Hey YouTube, welcome back to another video. Thanks for joining me. So in today's video, we're gonna be looking at how I care for my animals and keep up with the uptake in this room. So if that's something interests you, then please stay tuned. But without further ado, let's crack on with today's video. Hey YouTube and welcome back. So like I said, in today's video, we're gonna be going over how I care for my animals and keep up with the uptake in this room. So we're gonna go over what my daily or nightly or routine would be. So we're gonna go through each tank individually. Um, I thought I'd do this video off the back of the Q&A video that we did recently. So if you've not yet seen that video, then I definitely recommend checking it out and I'll leave the link in the description below. But a lot of you are sort of interested in how much work it takes to keep a room like this, especially with bioactive setups and fish and that sort of thing. But I think we'll go ahead and dive right into today's video and we'll make a start. Okay, so I thought we'd start off with Bert. So we're gonna give him a quick spray down first. Okay, so Bert's just currently come out of shed. He's got a little bit left on him, but he's pretty much got the most off. So just gonna see if he wants some food now. I did feed him yesterday, um, and he did take some food, but I'm trying to him, feed him a little bit more regularly lately, because he seems to want it a bit more. Just gonna feed him some locusts. I'll dust the first one with some calcium powder and see if he wants to take it. He doesn't seem to be too hungry. So I'll leave it there for him. And I'll just throw one or two more in for him just in, the, in his enclosure and he can take them if he needs them. He doesn't seem to be too hungry at the moment. But that's pretty much it with Bert. He has some water, he didn't want his food. But he looks pretty happy. Okay, so let's move on to the next enclosure. Okay, so while we're on the terrariums and the reptiles, I think we'll look at Castro next. So as you can see, Castro has left me a little present all down the glass, which is nice. I'll probably clean that out tomorrow. But just for this video, we'll just give him a feed and spray his tank down. Okay, so we'll give him some crickets now. And that's pretty much him done. Okay, so I think it's time to move on to the next tank.
Okay, so it probably doesn't look in the best shape compared to the last time you've seen this tank, but I did have an issue with the blinds in this room and in the summertime it scorched most of my plants and killed them all off pretty much. The fin's still doing really well in there and I'll go over this in a bit more detail when I do an update on this tank. For each night I do a water change on one of my tanks or aquariums, so we'll do this one today. So I'll put you down now and I'll rejoin you once that's done.
Okay, so we're just going to go around now and feed the fish in all the tanks. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed that and learned a little bit about how I do things and how much work it takes to keep a room of animals and fish. It doesn't take too long to be fair, it usually takes me the most half an hour every evening when I get in. Obviously I do bits on the weekend and do extra projects and things when I get time. Um, but the general upkeep of the room is quite straightforward. Um, I'll be doing some more detailed updates on each individual tank and enclosure as well as the animals in future videos, so make sure you stay tuned. I hope you enjoyed the last video I made of the escape from my desk with our new beta Bruce. I will be carrying on that series of nano tanks as well on my shelving unit and I will be doing another escape very soon. So if you're not yet subscribed to this channel then make sure you do and hit that notification bell so you don't miss any future videos. But if that's something that interests you or you like anything that I do then please give me a thumbs up, um, share, comment, anything I appreciate, any of your support. But again, a massive thanks for checking out today's video. I hope you all enjoyed it. And I think that's enough from me. And I'll see you next time.